<laughs> oh, there's an old guy riding a bike. Old man riding a bike. Oh man. <laughs> Get that old man riding a bike. What a way to kick off the video, huh? With old man riding a bike. <laughs> oh, what's going on, everybody? Frank Slauson here for another great daily summary vlog. What day are we on now? Number 34? <laughs> Oh well, not 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 uh, not uh, as hot as it has been, but uh, still a little warm in my vehicle because I had the window up. Because when I got to work this morning, it uh, looked like it was going to rain out, but it never did. So tough. So that's why it's kind of hot in my vehicle right now. Oh, well, anyway, so, what's going on? You guys are, I hope you guys have had a, a good 4th of July. I know my 4th of July will be pretty fun tonight. I, I as far as I know, we're going to be having fireworks in Greenbush. So I know they have races. They don't normally have races on Sundays in Greenbush, but uh, they uh, normally have fireworks every 4th of July. And I think that's one of the reasons why they're going to have the, the races and the fact because the the first four or five weeks that they're going to have uh, races in Greenbush, uh, <clears throat> it was they all they had to cancel every week because of rain and all that stuff, and they don't have a uh, pavement or whatever you know like cement or whatever it's just all just all like uh, dirt or whatever. So when it gets too muddy, which you know I guess is bad for people that are driving if it's too muddy. <clears throat> if it's too muddy, then it won't work, I guess. They can't go nearly as fast as they want to or whatever. Something like that. Anyway, so that's why they're doing this. But uh, they normally have uh, fireworks uh, during the uh, 4th of July, like normally around 10 o'clock or 10.30 at night. So I probably won't be getting any fireworks on the film. Sorry, you know, just kind of... Yeah, I suck, but oh well. So there's a lot more interesting things going on than just Fourth of July. Fourth of July stuff. I can't even speak. <laughs> I can't even speak today. I'm speaking Japanese or whatever. I'm speaking gibberish or whatever. Oh, but uh, now that I got my webcam and everything, I'm pretty excited about that. I'm very, very excited. Uh, it's going to open up a lot of a lot more opportunity for me that I haven't uh, been able to do before. And uh, with uh, some YouTubers. Uh, my personal selection and whatnot, and I were gonna do some stuff together, and uh, make some cool videos for you guys. Maybe even do like our own perspective on, like I'll record my perspe perspective on certain things or whatever, or you know on, on certain videos that we make, and then that person will, or persons will record their own perspective, like from wherever wherever they're located. So, yeah, fun times. Uh, but anyway, so not a whole lot going on today. Fourth of July, I pretty much spent all of my money this past weekend. I had two hundred and eighty-three dollars, you know, minus what I what I use for gas or whatever, a hundred dollars. So I, you know, normally it's like three hundred eighty-three dollars, whatever that I have, but uh, minus a hundred dollars that I save for gas or whatever for work and everything, uh, I had about two hundred and eighty-three dollars left. And that's just about gone. <laughs> but it's kind of neat because, you know, this is not just your normal month. We actually get paid three times this month, which is pretty impressive, I think. So it's nice to have that extra check so you can do whatever you want with it. I don't have a whole lot of bills in the first place, but, uh, yeah. But I was thinking because it is the 4th of July, uh, asking you guys a question. What are some of your greatest 4th of July memories I'll tell you mine, probably my all-time favorite 4th of July memory, and it has nothing to do with fireworks, it has nothing to do with just 4th of July itself, The fact it was the fact that in 2007, July 4, 2007, I had the opportunity to uh, uh, do a radio show, uh, got to do uh, an actual radio show, uh, like a two or three hour radio show, because nobody else was at the station that day, and I asked if I could... If I could do, you know, be on the radio that day, and the uh, stage manager who was there at the time said, "Yeah, to so go right ahead," and uh, so I did. And the cool thing about that, not just the fact to just be on the radio, but it, uh, Domino's Pizza used to sponsor us, 
And anytime we go on the radio, we mention about their stuff or whatever, they'd be listening to us all, all throughout the shift. And they'd throw us a free pizza or whatever, or whatever we wanted. That day, I remember getting a, a Thin Crust uh, Supreme. Or a Thin Crust Deluxe, I believe. I think it's probably deluxe anyway, but uh, it was good. It, it was great, you know. Uh, I don't remember exactly what I did on the radio. If I if I just played music or if I did an interview with somebody, I don't remember. I think it was just mostly just a music show, but eh. Well, that's probably my greatest memory thus far of Fourth of July. I mean, there's been other ones, but Fourth of July for me is pretty much the same every year. You know, at least for for now it has been. Uh, Normally right now, my hometown has a, a parade and everything, but because I'm working today, I never got a chance to, to record that or whatever, or shoot that. So I, I would love to record that. That would be kind of fun. You guys would love to see what our little town has to offer for parades and whatnot. But, uh, yeah, because I'm working till 6, you know, kind of root that idea. But, oh well. So anyway, you guys take care. Have a good 4th of July. Leave some uh, comments down below. Tell, us, tell me your favorite 4th of July moments or memories. Maybe they haven't even happened yet. I, I know that you know, with the, you know, the 4th of July is to come. I'm sure there will be a lot more excitement going on in the future, I'm sure, than there has been lately. But, oh well, whatever. <laughs> we'll see you guys tomorrow for another great daily summer vlog. Bye-bye. Hey, what's up, guys? Frank Slauson here. And... I guess you could call me kind of a little bit of a liar. <laughs> why, why are you calling me a liar? Well, remember in yesterday's vid when I said that I was probably going to be able to get any shots of the fireworks at all? Well, I decided, you know what? Well, I always said that because I didn't think it would work out. I didn't think that it would, you know, have enough time to do so. But, uh, actually, actually, we, I actually did. So, I uh, sit back, relax, and uh, enjoy the fireworks along with commentary from my parents <laughs> and myself and it might be a little dark but uh, I'll try my best to get some good fireworks shots so here we go really mm -mm. Huh. even Chubbs I we took him try to take him out there he was just shivering oh yeah dad had him and he was just I just noticed it and I says Larry he's shivering Huh. And Larry says, yeah, I don't think he likes being around people. Yeah, who knows? Maybe. Maybe it's just all the all the dogs and everything that uh, were at the parade and everything. Huh? I don't know. Well, Mom, you're on camera. <laughs> oh, really? I'm going to record the fireworks. Oh. I, I didn't think I was going to have time to do that, but I, I figured, well, might as well. Yeah. Delivers 1,200 milligrams of calcium and 800 IU of vitamin D in just two tablets, and you reduce the risk of osteoporosis. Seven pounds of oh, yeah, go And now big news. <laughs> you I think it'll be coming this way, probably, maybe, or unless they got a different spot. How close am I to that car, bro? Sit close. Huh? Get close. Contemporary Christian songs in the world from artists right here in the U.S.